Hello guys and welcome back to another Clash Royale video. Today we are going to play 2.6 Hog Cycle and I hope you all are doing great. So we are going to push in Path of Legends and right now we are in League 6 right now. So we are in the match and we are up against YX Scene. So let's see what he has. So we don't have Cannon in our first hand so I will start with Hog. So he played his Electro Giant from the back. So that was not a good defense on his side, but okay. So he placed his uh, Wall Breaker as well to take out my Cannon, but that didn't work for him. Let's wait, guys. I don't want to use Elixir. Okay, wait, guys. Uh, did we s just saw a hog? So this guy is running Hog as well. So we are up against Hog, Electro Giant and Wall Breaker. So 3 win condition guys. I think this is going to be tough in 2x. So let's see. So this guy is uh, cycling his uh, Electro. And I think we should put down our ice golem. We should fireball and electro over here. And I think he's going to play his hog anytime. So we are back to our cannon. So electro will get one shot on our cannon and this hog will get some damage. Okay. I think we should go in with counter push and let's put down our electro at the bridge for his bats okay nice our hog will get one shot let's hope for musketeer connection it will get two shots okay nice let's put down our log i think we should put down our cannon okay bad scary scary Okay, one skelly survived somehow and uh, it is, I think, still getting damage. Okay, nice. Actually, we didn't able to sort one larry on that side. Okay, musketeer doing some job. Okay, let's put down cannon like this. Let's get ready for his hog. Putting down ice golem like this. Okay, let's fireball and I think we have to log here as well nice defense okay, let's go in with hog and electro I think our electro will get some connection okay nice our hog will get one more shot and I think uh, we can fireball cycle now let's uh, log back his hog and uh, did manage to defend that well so he's getting aggressive with his electro so i will go in with my hog and our hog will finish off the game guys i think so one more fireball and that's it guys so ggs to him and let's move on to the next one so we are in the match and we have hog in our first time so starting with hog so this is a good way to know what your opponent is running or even you can catch your opponent sometime off guard as they don't have a good counter for hog in their first hand so that's going to be a free damage for us so always try to start with hog okay let's go in with our hog and you can see that guys we have out cycled him as he don't have a bomb tower so our hog will get i think one more shot and let's hope for one more okay so it will not get more than that i think we should put down our cannon like this and putting down our skellies and somehow our princess tower did manage to lock on to his uh, hog so a decent defense guys not the best but it will work for now we have hog in our hand but uh, he is back to his bomb tower so i will wait Okay, let's put down ice golem and putting down cannon like this and i think we should pressure him with our hog 
Okay, let's see. I think our hog will get one shot, maybe. So it fireball. Okay, fireball will take care of fire tracker. So he will get the king tower activation. Now it's easy for him to defend our hog. Let's put down musketeer like this and putting down cannon over here. Okay, so he used his EQ. Putting down ice golem to stop his mighty miner. Let's go in with our hog for the counter push. I think we should log. Anyways guys, musketeer will take out his goblins and... Okay, let's log. We don't have cannon guys. Okay, I think his hog will get some damage. Putting down skellies. Let's uh, go in with our hog. So I will try to get some fireball chip on his princess tower. As we are slowly approaching sudden death right now. I think we should have a log here to stop his hog from getting any damage. Let's wait. Let's get ready with Musketeer on defense. Let's go in with Hog. Let's put down our cannon. We will get some value on his Princess Tower. Okay, we are back to Hog. So we will pressure him, guys. We don't have Bomb Tower right now. So I think our Hog will get some damage, but he managed to cycle it back, guys. Musketeer will take out his bomb tower and I think he will get one shot. Wow, Musketeer is best, guys. Sometimes I think Musketeer is the win condition, not Hawk. As you always get the job done when it is needed. So here I will use my skellies to stop his Hawk from getting any damage. Let's go in with our ice golem and we will pressure him, guys. Okay, we don't have cannon right now. Let's put down our cannon like this and... Uh, I think we have to log here. Okay, I think. Um, oh, oh, what? What? Like, I just misclicked my fireball, guys. And look at that skelly, guys. It's connected to the princess tower. How did that happen? Wow. Let's put down our cannon over here. He missed his EQ, guys. And I think we should pressure him using our hog and let's go in with our log as well i think uh, our hog will connect to the princess tower and that's it guys ggs to him i thought i choked at the end but somehow we managed to get the victory guys okay so we are up against alonso so that last moment was really very awkward and i think i misplaced my cannon guys I think last match is not getting out of my head. Okay, let's uh, cycle our log. So this guy have uh, Hog Musketeer. It could be 2.6, maybe. Okay, let's uh, put down our Ice Golem. It's not 2.6, guys, as we don't have uh, Lumberjack in 2.6. Let's go in with our hog and. Uh... Oh, wait. Tesla placement work over there, but cannon does not work. I think that's a weird interaction. Maybe they should fix this? I don't know. Comment down below, guys, what you think about this interaction if we place a uh, cannon at that same spot hog directly go towards princess tower but when we put tesla it doesn't why is that okay i will fireball his musketeer and uh, he also have elite barbs so this deck is getting weirder i think this is elite barb hog cycle deck with lumberjack yeah so he is coming in with his lumberjack and I think we should use our evolved skelly to stop his hog. Okay, his hog will get one shot. Let's go in with our hog. I think he is back to elite. Let's see. Oh, yes. So he put down his 
Tesla. I think our hog will get some damage. Let's hope for it. Okay, two shots. That's great. Wow, one more shot. That was three. Okay, I'm happy, guys. Let's fireball his musketeer. And putting the ice golem like this. Let's log here. I think he's going to come in with his elite. Okay, I already knew it, guys. Let's put down our cannon like this. And uh, we also have the uh, evolved candy, guys. Okay, let's wait. I think we have to fireball over here, or else the, those evolved skelly will completely take out my princess tower. Okay, so he's coming in with his lumberjack lead push. And I think we should fireball. Okay, let's wait. He also used his arrows my god it got two shots on the princess tower and it's now down to 700 hp okay let's wait guys bad musketeer placement must my musketeer will take out his i think we should start cycling guys we have to cycle our hog our musketeer will get one shot nice let's go in with our hog guys I think we should put down our skeletons on his lumberjack. Our hog did manage to get some damage and you can see that guys our ice golem also did the work for us and uh, that cannon was really very close. Okay let's go in with our hog and I think he is back to Tesla. We have to win guys. Okay so I will log. And get some chip he's trying to do a hawk push guys okay let's put down our ice golem like this and i should log here guys okay the log was really close i will fireball cycle and i'm going in with my hawk that hawk was very close guys okay we are back to fireball and let's just finish the match i hope you guys enjoyed the video hit the like button if you like the video and subscribe to the channel for more such contents guys and comment down below what you guys want to see next so see you in the next video guys bye bye take care